Hi everyone, this is Killshot from 99 Gaming with a video for The Walking Dead Season 7. This is Negan killed Abraham Ford. So this can be difficult for a lot of fans to process. Abraham's truly one of the most beloved characters on the show. Who can forget such epic lines like, Who's Deanna? Or, Bitch Nuts. If you guys could leave in the comments below what your favorite Abraham line is, your favorite Abrahamism, I'd love to read it out and give you a shout out in a future video. So we've done several Abraham Theory videos up to this point. We've talked about the Orange Crush, how Abraham stole Denise's death. We talked about the RV, how Abraham's reflection was in the mirror when Savior told Rick to take care of those people in the RV. And who can forget the bro hug? But this is brand new evidence. Take a look at this scene. You might have forgotten about it. Eugene, Carl, and Abraham over on the far right. And if you look to the right of the RV, the cement column, there are red letters written there. We're going to zoom in on this, and you can see the words written, Damage Ink with a Red Rose. So I don't think that Damage Ink was just some random graffiti that happened to be under a bridge in Georgia when they were filming it. I think this was intentionally put here by the writers to foreshadow the death of Abraham. What is Damage Ink? It is a metal song by not that metal song. Although that metal head was in a previous scene because that's the one that attacked Eugene. And when he attacked Eugene, who came to save the day? None other than Abraham Ford. So yes, we're not talking about this one. We're actually talking about the metal band Metallica, who did the song Damage Inc. And over on the far, is that The Rock? He looks an awful lot like The Rock. Do we have a picture? Okay, well, we're not here to talk about what The Rock is cooking. We're actually going to go through the lyrics of the song Damage Inc. And I'm going to show you several lines and also the chorus and how that song accurately predicts what happens to Abraham going forward in the future. These writers do have a sense of humor. Dealing out the agony within, charging hard, and no one's going to give in. Living on your knees, conformity, or dying on your feet, for honesty. So I predicted in a previous video that Abraham would charge after Negan. Negan would take him down. Remember, Abraham was on his knees at first, and when Negan walked by, he actually sat up straight and got off his knees a little bit. That would be the lack of conformity, and Abraham is going to go after Negan, and he's going to die for honesty. But that's not the only part of the lyrics that we want to talk about, because we're going to talk a little bit about the POV as well, too. So in the chorus, it actually says, blood will follow blood, dying time is here, Damage Incorporated. So the column said Damage Incorporated. Dying time is here over Abraham's head. But what about the blood? Remember the POV scenes we talked about? We said we couldn't see the hair. We couldn't see other things. But one thing we did see in the POV scene was blood. And I think the blood was intentionally put there for a couple reasons. For impact. And I also think it's just another Easter egg for uh, the fans to sort of wrap themselves around. So let me know your thoughts below. We'll take a look one more time. Damage Inc. written right there. And right beside Damage Inc., very interesting, a red rose. So the red would be symbolic of the redhead Abraham Ford. So we also know that uh, Negan had a little song there, Eeny, Meeny, Miny, Mo. But as a special tribute to Abraham, the red rose, how about a Roses Are Red poem? So if you guys could leave in the comments below, let me know a special dedication to Abraham Ford, RIP. And I will go ahead and start. I'll give you guys one, uh, Roses Are Red. So Roses Are Red. Violets are red, tulips are red, bushes are red, oh shit, my garden's on fire. Thanks everyone for watching, my name is Killshot, let me know your comments below, give this video a thumbs up, and uh, let me know if you support, that uh, you think Abraham is the one that died at the hands of Negan.